Yo, yo, yo. What up, guys, and welcome back to another one. Just out here doing some scouting today, and as you can tell, it is extremely foggy. I mean, it's been dense fog all day. It's uh, sitting right at 10.30, and uh, since this fog has really set in, the birds just didn't fly this morning. It really pinned them down. So it's a late morning flight. So I'm just out here doing my usual Bobby things, and, and I'm out here doing my daily morning scouts and uh, getting ready to do another hunt, film another hunting video for you guys. And, and that's what this video is kind of about. This is kind of my response to a lot of you, man. My goodness, there has been an outpouring. Just a ton of you, a ton of you have DM'd me on Instagram. You guys have been replying on some of the recent videos. Pretty much ever since Flair put out his video about quitting YouTube and, and why that might happen and, and why a lot of channels might get affected from a big change. And then there's a section about firearms. So this kind of ties into firearms and, and the violent graphic stuff kind of ties into one. Essentially what YouTube is doing is if there's guns in the video, then your video can no longer be monetized or it's limited to ads just by having a gun. A ton of you have been hitting me up and been like, Bobby, yo, I heard about the bad news about YouTube. Like, what are you going to do? So I just figured, perfect day, not going to be hunting today. I might as well answer a lot of these questions that you guys have been asking me. And it's better to do it in one big video than rather typing out and replying to literally over a thousand comments. The way you guys responded and how many of you really shows me how, how many people out there that uh, changes like this one and uh, you know if they go through how many people that it could affect it, it, it could it could be a lot bigger than just affecting me and my income all youtubers we all get paid for ads all the 15 second ads that come across the videos that you can skip in five seconds all those all the all the big ones all the small ads basically us youtubers that's how we make our money I know that um, there are some changes on the horizon uh, I don't know 110% of facts and, and what could and couldn't happen, but what I do know is it's not going to be good. Like, it's eventually, it may not be right now, like it may not be in the next year, but within two years, I, I believe that there's going to be a big change. Now what that change looks like it's going to be like, it's getting windy, it's getting cold. Time to, uh, the old goggles are getting wet. It's spitting rain on us. Hunting on YouTube, guns, killing animals, you know, duck hunting, um, anything that I do on here, crow hunting, all those things will eventually probably not be allowed on YouTube, to be honest. So I found a write-up, and like I said, I don't know a whole bunch about this. I'm not an expert on this subject. Um, I just know what I know, and I found a really good write-up about, uh, it's basically the generalized theory of what's coming what 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 I'm gonna probably plan on happening so basically it says that uh, YouTube is getting to the size to where it's becoming shows and series just like me and flair and, and a bunch of us youtubers we upload on a schedule whether it's every other day whether it's every day it's like we are a show in a series and YouTube and their advertisers, the companies that place the ads, that pay to have the ads on our videos, YouTube wants to do two things. Is one, make it more manageable with the monetized channels because right now, YouTube's sitting at like three million monetized channels. So now what uh, looks like might happen is there's three million monetized channels and they want to get it under like 500,000. So what this write-up says is basically uh, YouTube channels under you know, like 100,000, 500,000 subs, yada, 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 all this criteria, um, and the big change. Basically, everything that I, I know, I'm just babbling. Basically, socialblade.com, that is like the almighty ranking system for all of us social media influencers, whether you're an Instagrammer, a YouTuber, anything like that. Socialblade.com is where you can see what you're ranked in the world. So basically out of 3 million channels, I'm ranked like 200,000 or something like that, 150,000, something like that. It just gives you an idea of where I kind of stand. So basically they want to get 500,000 highest ranking channels. Those are probably going to be the safe ones. Now, 
you might think, oh, Bobby, you're like 200,000, like you just said. You're safe. You're good to go. No, I kill animals, and I have guns in every single video that I do. So one of the criteria it talks about is it's advertising partners, a lot of them. Um, they've been complaining about guns because we all know what the, what the world is going through um, with a lot of the difficulties that we're facing with guns. Um, you know what I'm talking about. I don't want to go into it. I don't want to describe uh, any anything graphic or anything like that. But some of our issues going on in the public, uh, in, the, in the human race, with guns. And it's not hunting. Hunting is not one of those issues. But advertisers and, and big media platforms, they do. They get scared. Their, their panties get in a little bunch. And I, it's understandable because weapons, they're the talk of the town. Guns are the talk of the town. You know, they're all over the news every time another shooting or, or something happened, you know, and it's not good. So a lot of companies and, and social media platforms are being pushed in the direction to not allow guns and, and hunting, killing anymore. And I understand, but then you can't agree with it because there is not one thing I do wrong on this channel. And you, you all know that. And <clears throat> with your guys' support honestly has been amazing through this little deal. Um, it just shows that I don't do nothing wrong on this channel. Yeah, we, we have guns and, and we, uh, we go hunting and we kill birds and stuff. But it's all legal. There's nothing illegal about it and there's nothing immoral about it. Everything's cleaned. Everything's eaten. I, do, I try to do everything as right as possible. I don't... I don't allow a lot of profanity on the channel. You know, look at some of the YouTube, big, big YouTube channels that they do nothing but cuss. You know, who, my viewers, there's dads with their kids and their wives sitting down when they get home from work, sitting down on the couch and, and watching my latest video. So I jump through a lot of hoops to make sure that my content is clean and acceptable. And just to be told that everything that I've done, everything I've built, and how right I've done it might all just be taken away. And I'm not the only one. There's a lot of hunting YouTube channels out there now. And there's a lot of us that have gotten pretty big. You know, I'm at like 71, 72,000 subs. There's some that are much bigger than me. And we could all be heavily affected. There are some YouTubers that I've heard um, now have some different uh, buttons that they have to click and agree to when they're uploading. Um, I'm sure a lot of you heard that in Flair's video. He was talking about John B. and Rob and Demolition Ranch, Matt. Uh, some of them guys have been having to do some different things with uploading, like agreeing that there's no guns and this and that. And I'm not there yet. My channel hasn't been affected like that yet. Let's hope it doesn't get there. But the way this reads, this little write-up, that's the most legit thing that I found. It's saying 2020. 2020 is supposed to be when that big, big, big slim down of channels, you know, that big slim down getting it from 3 million to 500,000 monetized channels, 2020 looks like when that's really going to take effect. Now, there could be a lot of stuff happen between then and there. So right now I'm going to write it out. Um, I hope that all of y'all say a little prayer and let's all hope that nothing happens to this YouTube channel because I love it. It's my baby. Growing this community has been literally one of the best, one of the best things I've ever done as far as my career, my life, my goals. And without you guys, I couldn't have done this. So like always, thank you so much for all your support. And, um, honestly guys, thank you so much. Uh, for the most part guys like it's not just uh, Channels that have guns and do and do hunting or or just having guns in a lot of videos It's not just those channels that are going to be affected when this big fallout happens whatever happens It's not just the hunting channels uh, You're talking a lot of different influencers a lot of different big YouTube channels a lot of hard work that could a either just be deleted and gone or demonetized so that means that those people will not be able to make ad money they might still have a YouTube channel but you're not gonna be able to make any ad money it won't be monetized well here we go here's our first little feed I finally found the, the fogs finally lifting so you can see them in the fields 
Yeah, here they are. Check them out. Just prancing around eating in the fog. Not a bad little group. That's probably what? 50 birds out there. Oh, look at this feed right here. Holy smokes. Check this out. Now this is a big feed, boys. Look at how big that feed is. Holy smokes. That's a big one. That is a big one. My camera won't zoom any more than that. Woof. That is a pile of birds right there. Can you imagine? Can you imagine like me not being able to make just fun videos just of scouting and, and not being my routine anymore? You know, scouting is my routine all because of the channel. All to, all to keep bringing hunting videos to the channel for y'all. And uh, if you guys appreciate that, if you guys enjoy that, give your boy a big old thumbs up right now. But I thought it'd be a good idea to uh, scout and incorporate uh, the whole hunting YouTube guns theory and debacle that's going on right now. It's not a theory. It is reality, I'm sad to say. But I will say that I don't think we'll have to worry about anything happening to us for a little bit. Now, there might be some changes that come into place. Uh, for one, uh, they might start limiting ads. A lot of my long-term subscribers that's been here for a while, uh, you knew last year, it, it got tough. They were demonetizing my videos left and right. It was like I couldn't even do a how-to video to when I and I didn't even shoot a gun, I didn't kill a bird. But they were demonetizing my how-to videos all because I was a hunting YouTube channel and I used keywords like gun or shotgun or shooting or something like that. So, there's a, there's a million different reasons why they want to limit the hunting and the channels that have guns and use guns. And even if it's a good channel, they don't care. It's all about G-U-N-S. That's all it's about. Oh, look at that. Oh, check that out. I know it's hard to see, but uh, that's a little crow feed out there. That's quite a few. It looks to be about... That's about a 50 bird feed, little crow feed right there. That's what I've been looking for. Again, you guys have been absolutely loving the crow hunts. And you, hey, could you imagine like something simple as a crow hunt I couldn't do anymore? Like, it's just so ridiculous. It just gets me, it really gets me fired up thinking about uh, the possibility of me not being able to do this crow hunting, goose hunting, duck hunting anymore for you guys on video. That's just, I just, I just can't, that doesn't, that doesn't, seem right to me something about that isn't fair oh well that's gonna wrap up my scouting sesh for the day and it's probably gonna wrap up this video i hope you guys enjoyed it i hope i answered a lot of your guys's concerns and your questions because there has been a ton of you that's dm me on instagram by the way if you haven't followed me on instagram right here and a ton of you that's been commenting on the recent videos asking me hey bobby i watched flair's video what are, you, what are your two cents on this subject because you are a hunting YouTube channel? So, again, hope I answered all your questions. If I didn't, drop a comment down below. Ask me whatever question I didn't cover. Ask me it down below, and I promise I will cover them all. I'll be, I'll be churning it up down in the comment section with you guys, and we'll really hammer this thing out and, and, and get it talked about. Get it out there in the open. That's what my plans were on this video, was to just get it out there in the open and give my two cents and my feelings on it. My last take on the whole deal is I ain't going to change a darn thing until they make me. I mean, pretty much, until they're like, okay, uh, if you shoot another animal, you're not going to make another dollar on your whole YouTube channel. If they tell me that, well, then we might have to make some adjustments. But until that time, nothing's going down. Nothing's changing, boys and gals. But thank you all for being here. Like this video if you did. Drop a comment down below as well as the other one, but drop a comment down below and let me know what you guys want me to do. Whatever hunts that you want me to do most, I know you guys really been enjoying the crow hunting and the pigeon hunting, and believe me, we got more of that on the way. But thank you all for subscribing. We will see you all on the next one. Peace.